Hey guys, I'm back. In the last part, we unlocked the Enway's level 10 weapon. And now, we're going to go unlock Shuju's level 10 weapon. But keep in mind that this will be done in Legend mode. So we cannot combine the two discs of Dynasty Warriors 4 and Dynasty Warriors 4 Extreme Legends. Otherwise, you will have to do it in free mode at the Battle Tongue Gate. And you already know the rest. So, anyway, let's just get to it. So, since we are getting Shuju's level 10 weapon in Legend mode, we have to go to his Legend stage. So, there we go. And I'll show off the fourth model, like always. Alright, here we go. Alright, so we're in the narration and all that, so I'll skip that. The special rules, we already know. No bodyguards. The equipment, the weapon, as you know. We have the Bone Crusher at level 9. The items. Um... I'm going to stick with this, so I have the Tiger Amulet, Taurus Amulet, Speed Scroll, and the Power Rune. I can't equip any bodyguards. The objectives, all we have to do is defeat DN Wei three different times, and if I die, the time runs out, or if we allow more than 10 enemy supply units to retreat, we lose. The unit info, for Shuju's forces, all we have is Shuju, which is me, and that's it. For South South's forces, we have DN Wei, Eugene, and lead the end for now anyways all right let's do it so to get shuju's level 10 weapon here all you have to do is defeat dn way twice and when he appears for a third time the weapon will appear you don't have to do anything crazy but i would recommend you defeating enough supply captains that way you don't have to worry about supply captains retreating and you eventually losing so we're gonna go downwards and defeat eugene and his supply captain. I think once you defeat four of them, you'll be fine. Well, four uh, supply captains. Anyways. Because each enemy general has one and Dian Wei has three. For each and every time that he appears. But keep in mind, when you do defeat a supply captain, that respective general will be a little bit tougher to defeat. So, just be careful with that. And just like in Dynasty Warriors 3, take full advantage of the Musu attack uh, trap wall trick, if you want to call it that. But, um, it'll definitely help. Anyways, Eugene is almost down. There we go. Alright, Eugene's down. Now I'm going to head for DN Wei and defeat his supply captains. That way I don't have to worry about them retreating. But I'll keep DN Wei alive for now. There we go. Alright, now let's get out of here. Before the end, Wei fucking crushes me. We'll head up, defeat Lee Dien, then go back down and defeat Dien Wei. Um, I'm actually going to try to weaken Lee Dien first before defeating the uh, supply captain. Because if you don't defeat that supply captain, they're actually a lot easier to attack, but uh, when you're going for that level 11 weapon, you might have to go through all the shenanigans of after defeating the supply captain, having a very tanky enemy general. But um, anyways, now we'll go for Lee Dien. I saw that one coming. That works. I wasn't trying to do that, but I'll take it. Shit. Alright, 
the DN's down. Now we'll go for DN way. Yeah, let's uh not have that happen. That works. Alright, so that's one down, two more to go. And keep in mind he actually has to reappear for the uh, weapon to appear or show up or to say that you obtained it. Anyways, there's Yui Gene. We should be fine now with the enemy supply captains, but I'm just going to continue on doing what I'm normally doing. So here's the next supply captain. Alright, there's Yui Jean. Then the way reappeared. Alright, Yui Jean is down. Now I'll go for the way once again. Once we get him here, all we have to do is wait for him to reappear, and then the weapon is ours. And we can actually end the stage right then and there. Monchang will also appear, but that's not required to get the level 10 weapon here. So if I were you, when he reappears for the third time, just defeat him to end it. So far so good, Supply Captain is down, let's wait for him to do that. Yeah, look out for those jump attacks. Got him. Now we should be good. Let me, uh, I'll grab that. Ah, shit. And now he just reappeared. I should have just grabbed that. Well, we got the weapon. Now all I have to do is defeat the Enway. And as I said before, Mon Chang will also appear. But, um, that is up to you whether or not you want to go for him. Since I already have the weapon, there's no need for me to really... Shit, that is not good. Keep in mind, I equipped the power rune, so my defense drops uh, for the price of additional attack. It helps. If you know how to use it properly, it becomes very lethal. But, um... Just make sure you know what you're doing when it comes to that power rune, because you will get obliterated very quickly. There we go. You come with us. Mm, if you promise we'll make a world um with lots of laughing and lots of lots of food, then I'll 
I'll go with you. Right. That settles it. And that's a win. Alright, that's another weapon down, and we have a lot more to go. But, anyways, so Kato count is 130. Overly opponent count is 4. The only enemy general that we didn't defeat was Monchong. But, like I said, it's not required for this weapon. So, that's up to you on whether or not you want to go for him. You don't have to. Just make sure, if anything, defeat enough supply captains that way. If those supply captains eventually retreat, you don't have to worry about losing the stage. Because there's three for each and every time that Dian Wei appears. So that's nine. And then you have the other four. So that's 13. So as long as you defeat four supply captains, there's no way for you to really lose due to the fact that a certain amount of supply captains retreated. Because there's 13 and you need to make sure if you were losing that particular way you need to make sure you allow 10 supply captains to retreat but like I said you would not want to do that anyways so just defeat 4 and you have to worry about that anyways so a point total is 4,664 points not that it matters because if I'm not mistaken all points are at max yep so we got the stone crusher once again all you have to do is well for this stage anyways defeat the end way twice and then when he reappears for a third time the weapon will pop up if you're trying to do this in dynasty warriors 4 in free mode all you have to do is play the battle tong gate defeat my child sub officers or officers and then when south south meets up with uh hansui make sure he actually defects so that's all you have to do there if you're trying to get it in free mode but I'm doing all these once again, but this time in legend mode. So there we go. All right. The grade, it's probably bad. Yeah, a B. Not that it matters. Once we go for the level 11 weapons, we have to make sure that the, the grade is an S rank. But I'll talk about that when we actually go for it. Anyways, we will save and... There you have it. You've been watching my gaming adventures featuring Dynasty Warriors 4, in some cases Extreme Legends. Well, this time it is it, uh, it is Extreme Legends. And I'll see you in the next part where we'll go and get another level 10 weapon. And the next one that we'll be getting is Zhou Yu's. So, peace out.